present you the idea of 3D printers and the future it might have. My name is Pete Barish and I am a student in NTPU. The outline is why 3D printers, what is it and what will we do with it in the future. So first, why 3D printers? It's a new technology and you have a lot of business opportunities. There are still new ideas evolving every day. Uh, every day somebody has a new idea which material to use, but I will tell you everything later. This is the numbers. 31% growth per year. Uh, by 2020 it should generate 21 billion in worldwide revenue. In 2014 it was only 4.1 billion. So now maybe you have no idea what is 3D printer, so what is it? It's uh, some machine which uses heated plastic material to print objects. Maybe it will be easier to show you on a picture. Yes, it's Vladimir Putin. I just found this picture. Uh, here you can see the 3D printer starts at the bottom and creates layers going up and printing the plastic material heated. You can see that in the middle it's also empty spaces to save the material and time. And I think on this picture you can clearly see the one thin layers. The thinner the layers are, the more, de the more details you can create. And this is the final uh, object. Here is a practical use of 3D printers where this is a turtle who suffered from a fire in the forest. And they decided to make a model of the shell and create it and print it on the 3D printer. And this is the result. You can also like paint the materials after and everything. Uh, another thing about 3D printers is it's you can build yourself. It's open source hardware and it's self-replicated. So you can print a 3D printer on a 3D printer. So it's like this inception. Uh, here you can see those red parts. This is all printed on another 3D printer, on the father of this 3D printer, let's say. The only thing you need to buy are the iron parts, the, the computing units, like CPU or and hardware. And here you can see this is a string of plastic material, which is here melted, and then on the heat bed it creates the object. Maybe the video will be the best thing how to show you the, how it works. It's a time lapse of printing a statue, it's 30 seconds I think. So you can see it starts at the bottom create the layers and the uh, object is just happening. It's amazing, right? And if you have any questions, just stop me and ask if you have no idea what is going on. How, how does a 3D printer know uh, what to first, print it? First, it's necessary to create a 3D model in a computer and then do software upload it to the uh, input where does it save the printers. data save the data where uh, it's connected it's connected to computer oh, okay. it's the same like with regular printer you have to like in a word press any screen. regular computer a regular computer with special software oh, okay. so the future <coughs> um, we can do 3D printed limbs. This already works. It's very simple. Uh, you can 3D print houses. If you, instead of plastic, you use concrete, you just print the walls. In China, they printed 10 houses in, in one day, like this. Or you can print organs. Those are, yeah, it's kidneys. You will create like the cells and then use the first like uh, cells to create it. And that's all. So in the future, you can get 3D printed limb, yeah. So thank you for the attention. If you have any questions, you can ask me later. How long? 